What's up, gang? So we've got two actually really big pieces of news. Um, one leads up to the other. But uh, before I get into that, uh, if you could hit that like, subscribe, <coughs> excuse me, bell icon button and uh, share button, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, it's extremely helpful for the channel. It gives me great feedback on the content and what you think. And I want you guys to be in the know-how for everything that happens throughout the spring training season, regular season, off-season, all that. Um, we are also on the road to 500 subscribers, so I thank you all for that. So, the first bit of news is important because it leads, in, it leads into the second bit. Uh, the first bit is that the Yankees and the Orioles have made a trade. So the Yankees traded uh, pitcher Matt Crook to the Orioles. Um, and in exchange, the Yankees are getting cash considerations. Now, why is this important? Because it leads to the next point that I'm about to make. And this next point has some question, an open-ended question for everyone to answer and something to think about. Um it's important because the Yankees have now have a rekindling interest in NL Cy Young Award winner Blake Snell. That is on MLB Trade Rumors, which I will post in the description below for the link. So, could the Yankees get Blake Snell now? Well, it is possible. Uh, still, there are five Boris clients that have not been signed. He is one of them. Jordan Montgomery is the other. Cody Bellinger is the other. J.D. Martinez is the other. And Matt Chapman is the last. But Blake Snell is probably the one that everyone has their eyes on the most. This is <clears throat> because the Yankees just made a trade with the Orioles, which is very unlikely for them to do, to get cash and Back in return for a player, um, one of their pitchers. <clears throat> now, what does this mean, you might ask? Well, it means one of two things. They are either making room so they can wait or uh, get Blake Snell, or they are doing it because they're gearing up an offer to make Blake Snell. So one of two things, one of those two things is happening. Now, with that being said, the Yankees have a rekindling interest in Blake Snell. So, what does that exactly mean? That means that they are still interested in acquiring the services of the left-handed starter. So, this is big because now they're just waiting and playing that waiting game to see if Snell will come down or take lesser years for more money. Now, rem remember, they are over the Steve Cohen luxury tax threshold. So if they do sign Snell, it is now double that they would have to pay. So let's say they get him for 35 a year. For all intents and purposes, let's say they pay him 35 a year. They're now paying 70 million just to acquire him. So it's 70 million, in ta it's 35 in tax, 35 to him to Blake Snell so whether or not they sign him is yet to be seen but there's something brewing in Yankees land that we should keep our eyes out for because at this point with the news of the Yankees rekindling interest in Blake Snell is a very telling sign that something is happening and that they may ultimately land up end up landing Blake Snell <clears throat> so that's just something to think about now the question I have for you guys is, do you think they land Blake Snell? And do you still see that in the realm of possibility? Because at this point right now, anything is possible. They're not saying anything. This is what they do. So we have to really consider what the possibilities are. Um, Brian Cashman and Hal Steinbrenner are doing what they need to uh, pitchers and catchers have already reported, so Snell would have to sign soon to get a full spring training in. 
But um, with that being said, the Orioles made that trade with the Yankees to get Matt Crook in uh, exchange for cash considerations, and the Yankees have rekindling interest in Blake Snell. So, you guys in the comment section below, let me know what you think of all of this and what this means to you, what you see happening, what you don't see happening. Um, also, let me know if you think Blake Snell to the Yankees is still in the realm of possibility. Uh, please hit that like, subscribe, and bell icon buttons again. It is greatly appreciated. We are on the road to 500 subscribers. Um, and I thank you all for subscribing and showing the channel support. But until next time, guys, I will keep you guys posted on anything I hear. Have a great rest of your day. There will be the links in the description below of both bits of news. And I will talk to you next time. Have a great rest of your day.